Join us for an episode where we delve into the details of Salesforce Data Architect certification. It will help you prepare on the real exam questions, ensuring that you will develop a deep understanding of the concepts. Before we get started, make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss out on our helpful tips and updates. Now, let's begin. Question 1. Your organization has a high volume of service cases, and many of them are related to a single account, causing record locking issues. Which approach can help solve this issue? Question 2. Your organization is considering the use of big objects in its Salesforce implementation due to the large volumes of historical data that needs to be stored and occasionally accessed. What would be a compelling reason to implement big objects instead of standard slash custom objects? Question 3. As a Salesforce data architect, you've been tasked with implementing a system to classify data within the Salesforce platform for a healthcare organization. This classification should consider both the sensitivity and usage of the data. Which approach would best meet these requirements? Question 4. Your organization is implementing Salesforce Customer 360 platform. A significant part of this project is designing a data model that accurately reflects the customer journey across sales, marketing, and customer service. When utilizing object features, what should be your primary consideration? Question 5. Your organization has a single account with thousands of associated contacts. Performance issues have arisen due to this data skew. What approach could help mitigate this issue?